Hey, it's me again, and I'm, I'm here to talk to you more about the Flat Earth. But first, let me respond to the objection that, well, the reason the water falls off the BB is because it's so small, it doesn't have any gravity, and it's not pulling itself to go over to Earth, or right there, it will be blah, 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 Okay, okay, sure, sure, okay, fine. And I'm sure in an, that also an object in motion can stay in motion unless an outside force acts upon it. Sure, okay. Sure, okay. Okay. You got me there. Oh. Oh, no. But anyway. Something occurred to me. Another proof. The flat earth. It's just so obvious. I've never seen the curve. See, it's a geometrical, scientifical fact that when you stand on a curve, you can... Sorry, when you stand on a sphere... You look out, you can see the curve. You look out, there's a curve. And so you know you're on a sphere because you see the curve. I don't see the curve. So there's no curve. If I were on a sphere, I'd be able to see it. But I mean, when you go down, do you fall off? Like, in Antarctica, why don't they just fall off the bottom? But anyway, you're, you're going to tell me gravity as if that's a thing. Whatever. Uh, bye.